taking a moment to connect with yourself, with your body, with your space. Using your breath as a tool to bring you to this moment. And as always, I want you to check in. How are you feeling? This is day three for a yoga challenge. How does it feel so far? Are you still in that growth mindset? Hello lovely people, my name is Kristen, I'm an aspiring author, and today we're doing a 12-hour write-a-thon. So I haven't done a 12-hour write-a-thon in at least a year, if not more, and it's not something I love doing, it's very exhausting and time-consuming, um, but I'm in Act 2, and I am in the fun and games, and I would like to get to the midpoint because I would like to get through Act 2 as fast as possible so I can get to Act 3 because Act 3 I can usually do in like a day or two and then I'll be done and I'll have another draft finished and I've actually been really really enjoying this draft. Um, it's not like great by any means but it's been fun and it's been pretty easy going um, so far because my outline was so detailed which um, is gonna suck because I, I think I'm gonna have to keep doing these really detailed outlines every time because it really works for me. So, um, I, yeah, I've been writing pretty regularly, which is nice, uh, because that's not something that has been true, um, so far this year, but, uh, I got COVID. <laughs> um, so I went to a winery with my mom and my grandma and my aunt, and we all caught it. <laughs> and, um, I'm feeling better. My grandma's feeling better. My mom is still really sick. Um, she feels horrible and so I feel horrible because I I don't like when my mom is sick um, and so you know just keep her in your like thoughts because this sucks it's Mother's Day I would like to you know be hanging out with my mom but hopefully she'll get better soon um, and then because I was out with COVID and couldn't do anything couldn't sleep for an entire week which sucked um, but I got quite a bit of writing done. Um, I just sat in bed and worked and it felt really good. I haven't written without vlogging it in a really long time. And granted, not all of those vlogs ever went up, but uh, most of the time when I write, I am filming it. And there is something to be said about being able to just like write in your pajamas and like be free, um, not have to worry about like angles and lighting. Um, that was really really nice so i wrote uh over 7,000 words this week and i'm excited to get into it today and jump in and hopefully get to the midpoint um that would be i think five or six chapters of writing um my goal is to get around 10,000 words who knows some of my chapters are gonna be pretty short because that's just how first drafts go um so then I'm probably gonna be a little bit longer because again, that's just how first drafts go. So I think I'm ready. And now my phone's ringing. Hello? So it is a little bit later than I originally wanted to start. Um, it is exactly 10 a.m. But uh, I called my mom and we were talking. So <laughs> let's get started. Uh, I guess I'll be writing until 10 o'clock tonight. Sounds fun. Let's go. So it is 11 now, which means for the first hour I wrote 1,150 words, which is really good. Um, I did two 20-minute sprints in that hour because um, I find that if I just try to like 
right for the entire hour I'll get really burnt out so I like to do this in little spurts and sprints um, and yeah I also I finished chapter 14 and chapter 15 because um, they were both pretty short and chapter 16 is kind of a fun chapter because it is my main character and her love interest it's like their first like alone time together so I'm excited for chapter 16 and yeah feeling good so far I think I might make a snack in a little bit but other than that I'm feeling good let's keep going It is now noon and I wrote uh, 756 words in that hour. Um, so a little bit less, but that's fine. I also uh, made some avocado toast that was very good. Uh, so that took a little bit of time. Also, <laughs> so I'm writing chapter 16 and in chapter 16, the first half of the chapter is the main character in the love interest kind of having their own little moment. Um, it is a friends to enemies to friends to lovers dot 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 uh <laughs> so they're making up and kind of finding that friendship again at this point um and then also both kind of like this is friendship but i also kind of have feelings um so that's the first half and then the second half is a scary scene um where the main character is walking home and sees something scary <laughs> and um yeah so that's the chapter that i'm working on it's going okay i am struggling a little bit with the dialogue between the main character and the love interest um so i'm kind of just like not worrying about it and just kind of writing the scene as it comes right now and i'll go back and make the dialogue better in future drafts and so i'm not i'm trying not to worry about it but the, tra the chapters are coming out a lot shorter because I'm just kind of like skimping over the dialogue um, and just getting like the narrative down for now. So that's my update. I'm gonna keep writing. I'm pretty close I think to finishing chapter 16. Um, there's one more kind of like a conflict-y thing that's about to happen and then I'll be done with 16. And yeah, it's going good so far. It is 12.30 and I just finished chapter 16. Um, the main character has officially admitted to herself that she likes her friend and also that she needs to tell her friend a secret that might ruin everything because she waited a little bit too long to tell the secret. But things are going good. <laughs> um, chapter 16 was kind of long um, and kind of a mismatch because there's like three distinct scenes in that chapter, but that's for editing Kristen to worry about. Chapter 17 is like that, that scene that's in all horror, um, where it's like the researching scene. So main character is heading to the library to do some research and to find out some shit about her town. So that's the next scene that's gonna be fun. I still have, half hour left of, of hour three. So getting back to it. It is 12.45 and my wrist is really starting to hurt. So I'm going to look up some wrist stretches and exercises because I'm really not trying to like buzz my wrist. And I think it's just because I've started doing yoga. And so that's a lot of like pressure on my wrist. I need to get a thicker mat. Anyway, my wrists are hurting. So I need to, uh, not let that turn into like an actual injury so i'm going to pause and stretch a little bit
it is 1 p.m. now and I wrote 415 words for that last hour not very much I wonder if you guys can hear the wind it is so loud today um, it's really windy um, I wrote 415 words not very much um, compared to what I've gotten you know the first two hours um, and what I know I can do in an hour but um, dealing with some wrist issues so I did some stretches I moved to a different desk um, which has like different height um, my other one that I usually work at is a little bit too tall um, so I think I just need to figure out what way, what way is like most comfortable for my for my wrist so I moved to this desk hopefully this feels better if not um, we're just gonna keep moving around the house and see what works um, because I'm not trying to hurt myself and I'm trying to make it 12 hours and I can't do either of those things if I'm in pain so uh, also probably gonna take some ibuprofen just to like help um, also I ordered some boba because I've been craving boba and I'm gonna reward myself for this endeavor <laughs> so I need to get into the next chapter start chapter 17 and I will check in with you guys in a little bit It is now two o'clock and I wrote 860 words in the last hour. I also successfully procured boba. Um, it's not what I thought I was getting. The, my favorite place is directly across the street from my house, um, but they're closed on Sundays. So I had to order from a different place and I thought, I ordered strawberry green tea with mango boba. I assumed that meant popping pearls. I was incorrect. It's like tapioca, um, which is fine. Not my favorite. Um, the tapioca, it just, I always just envision it sticking to the inside of my throat and I don't love it. Um, <laughs> so, uh, mm, not what I wanted, but whatever. Um, for this next hour, I should probably make lunch at some point because this isn't going to sustain me, but I don't want to stop yet. So I'm probably gonna write for a half hour, see what happens, and kind of go from there. See if I want to stop and make lunch, or if I want to make it the other out, the rest of the hour. If not, I will have lunch at three, and then we'll see. Um, as for the writing, it's going okay. Um, again, just the dialogue is just not happening so far in this draft. So I, that's gonna be something I have to work on in my next draft, but trying not to worry about it, try to just kind of like get the gist of what the conversation is going to be and then move on. And so that's kind of what's going on. Um, yeah, that's, I think that's all. So going good. I'll see you guys in an hour. It is now three o'clock and I didn't write a whole lot that hour. Um, I got about 430 words in, so not bad for how little I actually spent time writing. Um, I kind of got caught up <laughs> posting on Instagram for my mom for Mother's Day. Um, but I, I'm really enjoying the pictures that I found of my mom and I. So I did that, that was fun. Uh, this is like the first Mother's Day that I'm not with my mom like in 
my entire life pretty much. Um, so I feel kind of sad. Um, so I hope that the silly pictures that I posted make her happy. Um, and I'll see her, I'll see her next weekend. But anyway, so I only wrote 430 words, but I did finish chapter 17. I don't remember if I said that yet, but I did. Um, started chapter 18, which is the midpoint, which was my goal for the day was to get to the midpoint. So I'm feeling good. Um, I, now my phone's ringing. Hello. So it is now 4 p.m. and I didn't write at all for the last hour. Um, basically, I just I made some soup and hung out and then the hour was up. <laughs> um, so I am still at the very, very beginning of chapter 18. Um, I have written 3,611 words so far today. So that's pretty good. Um, we are, I think we're at the halfway mark, which is funny. So we also just hit the midpoint of this novel. Um, I don't remember if I mentioned that in the last clip. Um, basically, I don't remember what I mentioned at all in that last clip because my mom called me at the end of it. But um, yeah, I'm really excited to be at the midpoint. That was like my goal for the day um, was to get there and we're here. And hopefully I can bust out a whole chapter in this in this hour. That is my goal. Let's let's see if I can do that. All right, let's get started. So uh, it is now five, I didn't finish the chapter. Um, I didn't look at my outline when I said that I was gonna try to write a whole chapter in that hour. Uh, this is a very long chapter, so that was not possible. But I did write 1,237 words, which is the most words that I've written in a single hour so far today. So I'm very happy with that. Um, I might be able to finish this chapter in this next hour, hopefully, because I don't, <laughs> I don't want this to be that long. Um, in this hour though, I did hit 21,000 words. I'm currently at 21,098 words for my draft. I am also at 4,848 words for the day. So almost 5,000, that's exciting. This is the chapter that never ends. It is six. <laughs> I wrote over a thousand words uh, in that hour. I think it's like a thousand and two or something. Um, I'm still not done with chapter 18. It's currently like well over 2,000 words in this in this chapter, but I'm almost done. I'm very close. <sighs> but this is the point chapter, so like it makes sense that it's long. But oh my god, <laughs> this chapter is really long. Most of my chapters are like 1,500 words. Um, and yeah, this has, it might get split up into like, at least two chapters in the next draft, but for now I'm just leaving it and we'll hopefully be done soon. I moved to my bed because I wanted to charge my laptop, but it is now seven and I wrote 704 words for the last hour. So doing pretty good, getting kind of tired, but I finished chapter 18, which is the important thing. And then chapter 19 is a fun scene that I'm excited to write. And it was also a short scene, which is also nice. So I'll be able to get to chapter 20, hopefully by the end of this hour. So let's keep going. I'm 
So it is much later. It is about 10.45 and um, I ended up getting a phone call that lasted like almost two hours and then I ate dinner. So my hours got all messed up. I don't remember where I last left you off at. I can tell you that I am 7,161 words in for the day. I just started chapter 20, um, which is the bad guys close in beat. Um, and for total words in my novel, I am at 23,411. Um, if I haven't said, my drafts, like my first drafts are really, really short. Um, and my cat is meowing. Hello. Rude. So it'll probably end up like under 40k, uh, just because I underwrite my first drafts. Whoa! And now there's a cat. Hi. So um, <laughs> my hours got all messed up. Technically, I am supposed to be done by now, but I ended up taking like a three-hour break. So I am going to write for a little while more, um, just so I can like finish up what I was like working on and get to a better stopping point than just kind of like leaving the write a thought hanging. Um, so I'm gonna get started and I guess I'll come back to you eventually. So it is now 11.30 and I'm getting very sleepy. So I think I'm going to call it for the day. Uh, I've been at this since 10 a.m. I think is when I started. So over 12 hours. Um, granted, some of those hours were not spent writing. But um, I wrote 8,084 words. I also wrote eight chapters. I started off and I was in the fun and games beat and now I am in the bad guys close in beat. I'm about to go into um, all is lost right after this chapter. So feeling really good. I have 10 more chapters until this draft is done. And I anticipate this draft ending uh, probably around between 37 and 40,000 words. Um, I know that's really short, especially for like my overwriter friends, um, but I'm an underwriter. So that's usually where my drafts end. My um, first draft of this, which is basically a different plot completely, um, that ended at 37,000. So that's what I anticipate. I think I can finish this, if not by the end of the next, this week, for sure by the end of next week. Depends on how busy my week is. <laughs> so I'm very excited. Thank you for following me on this impromptu 12 hour write-a-thon and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.